to introduce our student body president, Bobby Golden. Hello. My name is Bobby Golden, and I've had the great honor of being the student body president representing the graduating class of 2018. I would like to start with a little story. A couple of years ago, I participated in the spelling bee. A few of my good friends got very difficult words and unfortunately got out. Afterwards, they could have left, but instead they sat on the sidelines and cheered me on every time I spelled a word correctly. A few rounds later, when my time came to be out, I did not feel upset, and I joined my friends cheering on for the remaining players. At Colfax, we have learned not to be upset, but to continue to cheer for our friends. That's the kind of people Colfax teaches us how to be. Leaving Colfax is going to be a very bittersweet experience for all of us. Sweet because we're going to move on towards new adventures, but bitter because we're going to leave behind the memories that only we share. Memories like the first day of kindergarten, where we all met the friends that we would have for years to come, learning violin together as we struggled to learn dirty doggy scrub scrub, being one of the last classes to experience vaudeville with Miss Gage, our third grade field trip to the Science Museum, for which we raised the money by ourselves, participating in the Wax Museum in fourth grade and enjoying seeing how creative everybody's project was, and of course, Pally Camp. As we move on towards middle school, we will always remember the important lessons Colfax has taught us. For example, always have good sportsmanship, always try your hardest in every subject, and never leave anybody out, and to always find a way to stand on number eight for the cakewalk. As we stand here today, for perhaps one of the last times we will all be here together on this campus, we realize that we could not have done this without some very important people that have helped us so much. So I think I speak for the fifth grade class of 2018 when I say I would like to thank our parents whose laps we sat on during community reading in kindergarten, who planned Coachella and built the entire World Fair every single year, the assistants who kept peace in the classrooms, Ms. Stevens, Ms. Friedman, and the entire office staff who always keep us safe and on track, and of course, our beloved teachers who have guided us through our special elementary school years in the best way possible. We love this school. We love Monday morning assembly. We love talking and laughing with our classmates. We love the readathon, the holiday boutique, and spooky movie night. We love the World Fair and Coachella. We love the handball courts and the soccer field. We love the Halloween parade, we love eternal dodgeball, and we love the benches covered by the shade of the trees. But mostly we love knowing that wherever we go in this world, this will always be our elementary school. So as we move forward in this life, may we all be rude in education while we reach for the stars. Thank you.